And now your WZDX Pinpoint Weather with meteorologist Emily Owen. Well, we were 10 degrees warmer than what we saw for the high temperature yesterday. We saw right around 66 degrees yesterday. Here in Huntsville, we saw a high temperature of 76. 75 was the high temperature today in Athens and Decatur. 72 degrees in Coleman and 73 degrees in Pulaski. But right now, temperatures have cooled down quite a bit. We're sitting at 63 right now in Huntsville. 49 right now in Pulaski. 61 in Florence. 54 degrees in Russellville and over towards the east. It looks like uh, Fort Payne currently sitting at 57 degrees. Now for tonight, temperatures will continue to drop into the lower 50s for the overnight. Tonight we will be under a mostly clear sky and it is going to be pretty chilly out there. Notice winds will be coming out of the north northeast at around 5 to 10 mile per hour. Now for tomorrow, it is going to be a beautiful Memorial Day. We'll start the day out in the low 50s. We'll gradually warm our way up into the upper 70s by the time we get into the afternoon, and then we'll reach our high temperature of the low to mid 80s for uh, the day tomorrow. Now, if you are maybe taking your pet out on a walk uh, tomorrow, it is a good reminder that if the temperature is right around 85 degrees, the concrete feels like 105 and the asphalt is right around 130 degrees. So a good rule of thumb is if it's too hot for you, it is too hot uh, for your pet. Now, radar right now, we are staying clear and dry, and it looks like we're going to stay that way heading into the next few days. But it does look like we'll need our pinpoint viper heading into Wednesday. We've got another cold front that's going to be headed in our direction. So this is Wednesday right around 3 o'clock. Notice we'll start to see a few isolated showers move through. But it looks like the bulk of the rain is going to be coming on Thursday ahead of another cold front that's going to be swinging through. This is when we'll see our more widespread action and we could even see a few embedded thunderstorms with this. So rain coverage for the next few days looks like this Monday and Tuesday will remain dry. Wednesday we'll see a few isolated to scattered showers, but like I said, Thursday and even portions of the day on Friday we'll see uh, more widespread rainfall. Seven day forecast looks like this once again for Memorial Day tomorrow. High temperatures topping out in the uh, lower 80s will be in the upper 80s by Tuesday and Wednesday. But of course, we'll have another cold front that's going to be coming through. We'll drop our temperatures Thursday and Friday back down into the lower 80s. That's when we'll see some rain and even a few thunderstorms storms move through, but the good news is by the time we get into uh, next weekend, it looks like we'll see the sun come back out and temperatures will start to warm up once again. Okay, hey, we're looking forward to a beautiful Memorial Day. Absolutely. I'm ready to spend the day outdoors. <laughs> Thank you, Emily.